This week, 202 new stalls were installed throughout the United States and Canada, bringing the total stall count to 56,872. Blink added two stations, Tesla added 11, Electrify America added one, ChargePoint added 21, EV Connect added one. It should be noted that their stall count actually went down though, so they must have also closed some older stations. The Rivian Adventure Network added one. Let's go ahead and get to the data. First is Blink, and for the first time since I've been watching, this is actually what looks to be accurate data. Uh, the open date is relatively recent, uh, so this could be an uh, indication that Blink is starting to have some method of having data being reported into the database more cleanly. And Tesla, after a couple of weeks of uh, single digits, is back into double digit station count in a single week. One thing of note, there was a Tesla supercharger station that opened up uh, relatively close to my house along my commute route which is not in here, so it must be laggy. I never really knew to what extent, but I have a good way of knowing now because the station opened just this past week, and uh, by all accounts, it should have been in here, and it is not. Regardless, we've got a couple of 20 stall stations, which is always crowd pleasers, uh, 16 in Robertstown, Texas. No magic docks. Uh, this is the first time I've seen it where no magic docks have been in here. And here's ChargePoint, uh, nothing really to call out. There is this Alabama Power, which also added many ChargePoint level two endpoints as well. So I guess Alabama Power is starting an initiative in order to install uh, electric vehicle charging. And um, this Washington one looked to be of interest because they're ChargePoint Express Plus units. There's two of them for a total of four stalls. Electrify America, through their partnership with Evolve New York, opened one in Churchville, New York, four stalls. Eva Connect had a pretty slow week with only one one stall station, which is very unusual for them. Normally they do about five, uh, sometimes as much as eight. Normally there's uh, multiple stalls, but this was a quiet week for them for some reason. And the Rivian Adventure Network opened a new one in San Bernard. San Bernardino, California, nine stalls, which is a unusual number for them. So likely there's an additional couple of stalls that just didn't get activated or commissioned that will be um, added in the coming days. I have two honorable mentions. One is BP Pulse, adding two stations, one in Florida, one in Virginia. Uh, so they're continuing a pretty steady pace here. The next one is Zeph Energy, added an eight stall station in Knoxville, Tennessee. The reason this is of note is because that's ChemPower. And by my count, Zeph Energy now has four ChemPower stations in eastern Tennessee, two of which are eight stalls. Thanks for watching.